Hello, good day, welcome to another T-shirt design tutorial. My name is David Oisamoji. I'm the owner and founder of What's a T-shirt Design. So as you can see, I've put up 40 episodes already, 40 episodes up on my channel. So if you're watching for the first time, I want to say welcome. Thanks for clicking through to my video. Thanks for staying through. I know you want to learn how to make T-shirt design that sell. That is the reason you're watching this video. I won't disappoint you. I will never disappoint you. All I'll say is subscribe click the red subscribe button turn it gray and hit the bell notification and make sure you like this video so that you don't miss out we start wasting much of your time let me go straight into today's video as you can see i upload video every single day so there's no day you're gonna miss out on a new t-shirt design video so if you want to always have the idea to design more keep watching so without wasting much of your time let's open photoshop i use two apps to design photoshop and canva so for this one, I'm going to be using Photoshop. So to become a king or a queen in t-shirt design, I would advise get used to these two apps, Photoshop and Canva. Canva is an online app. You just have to go through your Chrome browser or any browser you use, canva.com. But Photoshop is a software you need to download. So without wasting much of time, let's get straight right to today's own. So I'm just going to click on new. This is the standard 4000 by 500 pixel. That is the standard. I'll click OK. The next step please follow all the steps follow all the steps if you want to let next step will be to click on this double tap on this icon that's the padlock you can see then press ok we are doing that so that we can turn this background off when we're done designing with canva you can you, you can turn the background off but you need to be on a paid plan to do that with photoshop once you have photoshop you can do that from start so but we'll do that at the end so without wasting much of time we're just going to type in the text and this one is just going to say never say don't don't give up so it's gonna say don't give up as you can see it's quite small it's quite small and you can't even see it you can't see it so i'm gonna do my control t i did like that so that i can show you different processes I'll see I've done control T you see it has highlighted it. So I'm just going to hold my mouse to this edge and I'm going to click on three buttons, my alter key buttons, my left mouse click button. I'm pressing them down together. Alter key button. Sorry about that. The three buttons I'm going to press down together. My alter key button, which is the first, shift key button the second, and my left mouse click button. Then I'll drag my mouse outwards. I'll drag my mouse outwards. So you see. My mouth has been dragged outward then i'll press enter as you can see you can't still see because the color is not super clear so to, to change that i'll just double tap here on this layer don't give up layer i'll just double tap here just double tap here then i'll go to color layer as you can see you can see it now it's better but i want it to be far better so i'll just just make it something Okay, think I like this. Think I like this. So just click OK. This is just the first step of so many. The next thing I want to do is to add some effect to this. To add some effect to it. And so this effect is going to be a simple one. But to add those effects, I have to add something. What is that thing I have to add? Let me show you. It's the ruler. As you can see, this is a ruler. You can see. So to get that, you do control arrow on your keyboard to, to get it out. Of course, your, your Photoshop will always come without it. So you do your control arrow to get it out. Then you're just going to drag them in. I can do it without the ruler, but for some people's sake, I'm going to do it with the ruler. can do it without the ruler. I'm a pro in this. So, but for, some, for the sake of some people, you might have to use the ruler. I just have to use the ruler for me I can do it without the ruler but for this I'm gonna use the ruler so that you know how to use the ruler so you just go to the edge and drag as you can see I've been doing that you just drag with your mouse note you can't just drag if you're not pressing your left mouse click button so always do that you press on your left mouse click button drag your mouse outward to bring out the ruler always make sure you do that always make sure you do that so I'll just 
do it for you you see to if just watch this to the end you see to create a super good effect if you're enjoying this video so far please hit the like button leave me a comment if you want to see more on this just hit me a comment if you if you don't understand any part just let me know in the comments i will definitely get back to you i reply to almost all i won't i won't say i reply to all but almost all almost all i reply to almost all oh sorry about that i reply to almost all almost all my replies so as long as i see it and it's related to making you understand things i will reply to it definitely i'll reply to it definitely so please make sure you follow these steps these steps are quite easy if you if you don't put a lot of work into your design i can bet you it will attract people's interest so i'll just tell you just go through this stress this us and just grind in a good design it's design that stands out design someone wants to, to wear not just any out designs design you know someone you want to wear then you are good to go you're super good to go when you do that so now we are done with that so i'll just come to this edge and drag one down this one is just to be placed here so now what is the next step i'll just come to this sh shape tool i'll press it down my left mouse click button and i'll select this so i'll just come over here and do this just do this just do that i'll do that here again do that here again I'll do it here again and I'm sure you're getting you're getting the drill now you've seen you see what I'm trying to get out of this see what I'm trying to get out of this so it's, it's not that complicated it's just that you just have to make sure you're getting the best design out as possible try to get the best design out as possible very important you do that that's the best way you can make sales on Redbubble, T Spring, Match by Amazon, um, T Public. You just have to grind and produce a super good design, like the one I'm showing you right now. Just have to grind, produce the design. Super easy. Once you've done the design and you've uploaded it, just give it time. If you are new to this site, the site I mentioned to make money. If you are new to those sites, it's gonna take time. But once you get your first five sales, um, I can guarantee you, you will never stop making sales. It's just a guarantee. They just need you to, you know, they just need that trust call up. And once you get that, you start making sales. It's just it was what happened in every business. If you don't have a trust call, people find it hard to believe you. So that's just it. As you can see, we have we have a design all out now so just click on this one then I'll just so that you can see it clearly I'll just take I can decide to take this arrow out so you just see it clearly you see it clearly what I was trying to fix here so you just it's to be super clear for you it shouldn't be complicated super clear as you can see the design I'm trying to make here you can see the design I'm trying to make here we are not done yet so please don't click off I'll advise you watch keep watching don't click off we're not done yet just one step for this to be done and you are good to go and you can you can do this with any any right top you want it's just i'm using this just to show you and by the way if you use just the exact thing you're seeing now you're going to get suspended on this site i've mentioned above why because this design will be up it's my design i'm just showing you i'm not going to hide my designs from you i'm trying to teach you here and that's why i just ask that you subscribe and like this video that's the best way you can help me 
that's the best way you can tell me thank you and the best way I can tell you thank you is to teach you what works to teach you what works definitely to teach you what works so if I'm doing that I'm sure you can do this for me so the final step I'll just click on this edge go to color color overlay and I'll just click on this so you see you see the design I'm trying to get out here you can see the design I'm trying to get out here you can see so I'll just click on this and just shift this down a bit so now see what I'm trying to do here see what I'm trying to do here that's how we roll and that's how I want you to roll so now the final step remember what I told you to put up the background at the end now we have it without the background and I'll design it ready please to your right you see a playlist make sure you watch that playlist watch it well if you want to learn and I'll see you in tomorrow's video have a lovely day bye